for more than a century, scientists have been trying to figure out exactly what consciousness really is, how it works, and where it comes from. And while many questions remain to be answered, it appears some researchers have now discovered what they call an on-off switch for human consciousness. A group of scientists at George Washington University say they were able to switch off a woman's consciousness by electrically stimulating a single area of the brain. The research was published this week in the Journal of Epilepsy and Behavior and claims the scientist discovered the, quote, switch on accident while working to pinpoint the causes of the patient's seizures. New Scientist reports the group was targeting the claustrum, a thin sheet-like structure that lies hidden deep inside the brain with electrodes. Gizmodo explains that's when the woman unexpectedly lost consciousness. Unlike a seizure where a person's activity immediately stops, the patient seemed to slow down, speaking more quietly and moving more slowly until she was silent and still, unresponsive to voice or visual stimulation. Once the electrical stimulation was turned off, she regained full consciousness, but with no memory of what had just happened. The Huffington Post quotes prominent American neuroscientist Christoph Koch as saying, this study is incredibly intriguing, but it is one brick in a large edifice of consciousness that we're trying to build. Ultimately, if we know how consciousness is created and which parts of the brain are involved, then we can understand who has it and who doesn't. While the presence of this on-off switch has only been recorded in one patient, this discovery has potential to help people with epilepsy or who are in semi-conscious states, which means you'll probably hear more about it in the months and years to come. For Newsy, I'm Zach Toombs.